welcome to Marissa's Kitchen. Tonight I wanna do a review of the Crock-Pot Buffalo Chicken in the Trim Healthy Table Cookbook, and I'll put the page number at the end of my video, but um, I'm really excited about this recipe. I've had it, this is the second time I've made it, and it is probably one of my favorite THM recipes that I've had, um, right up there maybe in like my top 10. Doesn't that look delicious? So um, I made it in my Instant Pot, which is like, this is probably the third thing I have made in my Instant Pot, so I'm really new to the Instant Pot world. But what I love about this recipe, especially in the Instant Pot, it's cooked in a half an hour in an Instant Pot, if you're not familiar with those. Um, they're pressure cookers. And anyway, my family loved it. The guys really liked it. If you like buffalo stuff, hi. someone wants to say hi. So, um, Brennan can't eat this one because he is dairy free and doesn't really like spice at all. The first time I made this, I had it over, no, I didn't have it over anything. I put it in a tortilla with cheese and <clears throat> it drips a lot. In fact, I'm gonna add a picture at the end that shows my husband's plate from tonight and just how drippy it is. So it was really good, but it does you know, leave a little bit of a mess on your plate. And um, it was good like that, but I just kind of felt like something was missing. So I had my, seconds of that and also my lunch the next day I had over lettuce and made just like a buffalo chicken salad and that was really good um but still kind of felt like I wasn't a hundred percent like sold on either of those so I saw on Instagram that um someone had mentioned a buffalo chicken slaw and they mentioned that they had some buffalo flavored chicken that they threw with some coleslaw and they used ranch and some cheddar cheese and I think they maybe even added a ranch package of ranch seasoning um, which not all of those are on plan but um anyway I really like the idea of just adding uncooked cabbage to it so I had a head of cabbage in my fridge and that's what I sliced up tonight and I mixed in a small bowl just some shredded cabbage and the meat and some I used blue cheese dressing and then some cheddar cheese and I ate a few bites of it just like that and it was really really yummy and then I also took a low carb tortilla and put that mixture um, kind of like my buffalo slaw inside a low carb tortilla and that was the best way that I've had out of all these ways so I liked it both as like the regular slaw and in the tortilla and I would definitely eat it like that again it just kind of I um, shred my chicken in my mixer and it ends up um, it can get too mushy if you let it I don't I don't know I found like I almost rather shred it by hand if you don't want kind of mushy shredded chicken and so this ended up just really acting as a nice um, buffer for the mushiness in you know giving some crunch in your tortilla so um, I just love this recipe it reheats really well I have a feeling this one would freeze re really well as as well and um, yeah definitely you should try this one if you love the buffalo flavor of stuff then you would like this one a lot hi I am having the buffalo chicken um, in the coleslaw version again for lunch today and I just cannot get over how delicious this is um, I'm telling you this stuff is so good I can't believe you can lose weight eating such delicious food so hope you try it and enjoy it and oh and I did check on the name of that person who I heard about it on Instagram and her name is Krista Siddall or Siddle. I, I don't know if I'm saying it right, but um, and she goes by wannabe CrossFit on Instagram. So anyway, thank you, Krista, for your awesome idea. And um, yeah, I hope everybody tries it because it's just really yummy, really amazing. One of my probably one of my favorite THM meals. Um, I know I put it in the top ten, but I think this crock pot buffalo chicken might be top five. So maybe I'll tell you in another video what all my favorite ones are. All right, Brennan's having fun. Are you running around? Yeah. Show him how you run around. <laughs> Seriously, we run, we run, we run laps in our house. <laughs> when I'm doing my Leslie Sansone videos, um, we literally do laps. 